Sydney Style, and you're watching my A to Z trend guide. So every Tuesday and Thursday, I've been breaking down the hottest trends from the season and showing you guys affordable ways to wear them at home. So today we're on the letter U. U is for urban plaid. So why do I say urban plaid? Well, plaid is in every year. It comes back every fall and winter, but this season it's really about making it fit for the city. So one way to do this is by contrast. So I started with this plaid flannel shirt, which can be really rugged, very country, and then I contrasted it with a very feminine skirt. So a pencil shape is a classic, and I did sequins to kind of dress things up so I can actually wear the flannel to a holiday party. If you're not a fan of so much sparkle, you could also do a leather skirt. If you check out my blog, Sydney Style, I actually paired the same shirt in black and white with a leather skirt a few weeks back, um, and then I just finished it off with some classic black pumps. Another way to make plaid more urban is with hardware and leather. So I started with this little plaid skirt, which has these cool zippers on the bottom, which gives it more of an edgy feel. And on top, I did double leather. So I did this little leather tank and my favorite leather jacket that I wear all the time. Now, since the skirt is on the shorter side, I did some black opaque tights. It also keeps you warm. And then if you remember, Q is for quilted. So I added these quilted booties. So what do you guys think about the trends? Leave a comment in the section below. You can always ask me your questions too about any of the trends we've been covering in this whole series. And I wanna see how you are making your plaid more urban. So upload a photo to your social media and just use the hashtag SSTrendGuide. And I've been posting my favorite trend girl of the week both on Facebook and my newsletter. So you definitely wanna check it out to see if you made the A to Z trend guide cut. And for more inspiration, you can check out my blog, Sydney Style. I actually did a whole staple series on a plaid flannel. So you can see three more ways to wear it. And I'll see you every Tuesday and Thursday for a new trend guide.